my name is Lizbeth Martinez. I am actually going to honor my mentor today. And her name is Rebecca Kaplan. Um, we've been together for as long as uh, I've known for about eight years or nine. <laughs> um, Kaplan, hmm. She came into my life when I was going through a lot. Um, I was a really stubborn, hard-headed little girl growing up um, because at home I didn't have a really, really a home to call. Um, it was more like a jungle. <laughs> um, it was a lot of problems. I didn't have no one to really talk to about anything that was going on. I didn't feel safe at home because of issues that were going on. Um, at school, I was being a bully, um, I wasn't, I wasn't as happy as a child, I didn't have a childhood to recall, to be like, oh, I had a childhood, and that was great, no, I had to grow out at a young age because of, um, I had a big family, I had, I came out of a big family of nine, and, um, I'm the youngest of the girls. I have two little brothers. Um, and the rest are older. And I never had no one to look up to. No one to say that they were my my heroes or role models because they were all going through something as well. Um, but right when Rebecca and I got introduced, I was, um, I didn't like her at first, and she knew that, she always, we always laugh about it, um, I didn't know her, I really didn't open up to her, it took about almost a year for me to open to her, and I opened up because she opened up, and she, she gave me a place where I felt secure, a place where I know I could trust a place I felt loved and I knew she would never let me down and to this day she haven't and I'm so glad to have her in my life. Um, she helped me become the young person I am. I was able not to graduate but because of her I did. Because of her I am in college. Because of her I, I become that strong woman I am now. Because of her I have strength to move on from problems, to look forward in life, and to to not say I have dreams, to not say that I could do it. Because back then I used to have low self-esteem and I was just really hard-headed. I didn't care what people had to say because I knew life wasn't nothing. But now when she came, it was just like, it all turned around and um, now it's butterflies and <laughs> and people tell me like I still look back and I'm like wow like I changed that much like she did this and and um Holy also took a big part about it so she's also my big role model she has a big heart and they, those both ladies work so hard to change to change not to change me in a bad way but to change me to give me life to give me a heart to really think about me and um I'm really glad like I have both of them. Now I am a young woman you could say and I'm going to school. Um I'm, I'm I'm working and uh um I'm continuing my life and and it's better. I'm glad they're still here to this day and they're still I know those two people and I know all YMC will never leave me down and um they push me in to become a better person, to become a better woman. When I need help, they're there. When I need a shoulder to cry, they're there. When I have to let my anger out because someone made my day or my month or my year bad, like they're there. And that's what that's what I needed back at home. And I got it somewhere else, but it's a place where I call home now. Uh, I would like to open a foster home where I know I could have probably even have a connection with youth mentoring connections they can have mentors they can have people that love them that are gonna give them um give them love that they never experienced so they will never they they will know after getting out of the foster home you know what i'm gonna be a person i'm gonna be a lawyer i'm gonna be 
I'm gonna be like you. I want one day to someone be like, I wanna be like you, Liz. But it's gonna take time and I know I'm gonna be able to do it. I have grown as a young woman. Um, I've been through a whole lot of things and I know kids that have been in foster homes could be someone and they are someone and um, hopefully I'll be the one to change their life and hopefully I will do it.